I've been trying to make more like cinematic kind of style vlogs, whether that be like, I don't know, framing or just color grading. I, I've seen like a lot of kind of cinematic style kind of shit on YouTube and Instagram lately. And I like how other people do it. I've been trying to get more into it. And so I guess one of the main problems I've always had is you gotta make like some good looking frames, you know? And then, you know, you gotta walk past the camera and look goofy, come back, pick it up. But the thing about that is it makes it look better. As goofy as it does look to come back and pick up your camera after you just walked past it as a grown man, like it does make the overall video look better. And that's not even the biggest problem to be honest with you. Like I'm okay with looking a little bit weird to some strangers. Um, but the biggest problem I think is you're putting down you know, however thousands or hundreds of dollars in your camera equipment and then just walking away from it, you know what I mean? But yeah, so I have like a pull-up bar that's down the road from where I live. And on like a side note, all of the sound that was recorded when I was doing my workout was completely the on-camera microphone. And I think it did a crazy good job, like that shit sounds crispy. So for my workout today, it was just kind of... Uh, 75 pull-ups, 75 dips, and that's just kind of an arbitrary number that I came up with. So, yeah. Today's video topic is the locked-in syndrome. Also another shout out to the second generation AirPods Pro dude cause I did not hear shit the entire time I was working out the noise cancellation on those things is insane.